Here we are, beautiful Alberta, February 28th, 2017. This is the end of the cat season here for us. Usually it shuts down a little sooner, like I've said before with the quota, but this year it hasn't seemed to close. We're not sure why, but it hasn't, so we're taking advantage of it and hunting right to the last minute, as the frozen men usually do. Uh, Sandy, cut a track uh, about one o'clock, it's 2.30 now. We're kind of done for the day, didn't cut any fresh ones and had to go to work, got called into work. Lucas had to go take care of some business. So we called her a season, but Sandy just called us. He cut a fairly fresh one close to home, so he's gonna box it on his sled right now, try to figure it out, see how old it is, and uh, just see if he can kind of figure figure things out. I've said that twice now, but you can piece this together. You wanna figure this out? We're gonna figure it out. So me and Lucas, we're gonna go grab Scott's truck. I broke mine three days ago when I got stuck in that hole. Lucas wanted me to cross the river, I said no. Yeah. He called me chicken. Don't say whoa in my bowl. <laughs> We're gonna go grab the hound, Scott's truck, load up, meet Sandy and see if we can run this thing. One last kick at the cat. <laughs> <laughs> see folks. Like I can't figure this. Hmm. When I go up the pipeline, there's one goes that way and one comes back. Really? So is it coming this way and going that way? Well, or going that way and coming this way? That's, I'm guessing it's the same one came down, went around, and then back in. Yeah, let's see where it goes in. How I'll far see. up? Just right. You'll see it going this way first, and the next one's going this way. Okay. But it looks bigger here. Really? Ooh. I thought. There's only two across the pipeline. It's got to go that way and back. Mm -hmm. Unless it's two different cats. But my guess now is when I see this one come out here, just around, made a circle and went back in. They have the colors. They're all on. Oh. Yeah, they're already on them. Oh, you guys are ready to roll. Oh, yeah. Oh, that this one? Yeah. Here, just hold him for a second. Come on, Come on, Cash. Dogs are 487 yards, kind of the west of us. We got a pretty good logging road, as you can see here. It's easy driving, easy tracking. So we're gonna rip up. See if we can head them off or get up on a high spot and just listen for them. We didn't see that cat come out of this box, but it's late in the season and uh, lots of grass showing in some places. So just kind of have to dump the dogs and let them figure it out. See where it brings us. Come up here. How far are they? There's straight snow. I think they jumped it out of its bed there. They did a couple tight figure eights and then lined out and they're pretty loud. Three hundred and thirty yeah, just right four yards. I'd still go right up the road by sound. But... Yeah, let's do that. I think this is four K, can almost see your fucking mustache. Buddy, you could record my mustache with an old hand crank camera. I think we might just hang tight right around here for now. We might come back to where we were because they're just circling there and we were only three, four hundred yards there. And it looks like they might have it treed or might be circling it. So back to that cut line by the gate, I think is our best bet. Yeah, they sound not too far from here. Yeah, and I think they might have it, possibly. So we'll just probably come back there, I think, unless all of a sudden they make a mad dash this way. Cash is still in the same spot, Shorty ain't. As you can see here, folks, it's been quite the little ring around the rosy here with that cat. It's doing all sorts of circles on the boys. 
We're not sure. It sounded like they were tree barking. They were both treed, but now our one dog is kind of moving, so we're not sure if they have it or not. But we'll hike in there and we'll take a look and find out. Keep what's the saying, Cash is treed, so we're gonna walk in, see if he's got it, or we gotta help him out. Cash really sounds like he's well. Cash is treed for tree, sure, but if it's a cat tree or a. And wood tree. When we get close, we won't dock at all because I don't like them hearing us coming in. Cat tree or wood tree? I'm thinking wood. Well, let's keep. Oh, did you grab leashes? Nope. I got one. That's good enough to hook two dogs up. same loops as he's been doing. Cash, where's that cat? Where's that cat, boy? I just walked up to this tree and there's a small cat up there, so they did tree it, but they left the tree looking for it. But straight up there, you can see its tail sticking out. Here, boys! Here, boys! Here, boys! Can you get a decent shot? Come on, Cash! He's got a branch in his face. one up a tree here. Looks like a young Tom. We'll leave him for next year. He's just a little guy. Last day, Tom's still open, but he needs about 85 more pounds, so we'll leave him and hopefully we'll see him in five or six years and his kids. Want some food or Go get him! Well, last cat of the year for the frozen men. Sandy cut this tractor on 130 and let the dogs go around 330. <clears throat> had it in the tree probably half an hour. They had it treed for a while. We just didn't get there in time and they left the tree, but we picked up its tracks and saw it up there. We could see its tail hanging. We we're just walking the dogs out and leaving that one up there for next year. Pardon me? Is that the tree they were first at? Yeah. <laughs> 